four months after the disaster. Most of the 298 people killed, 193, were Dutch. Investigators still trying to piece together what exactly happened on July 17th. Five bodies were discovered at the crash site recently, with the Dutch government warning it may be difficult to find the remaining nine missing people. With more, here's Delano de Souza. More burials as investigators continue to look for answers. On Saturday, the Dutch foreign minister said the nine missing bodies of M817 crash victims may never be found. But investigators, he signaled, are still hard at work. Uh, the international uh, investigation team, uh, led by the Netherlands, is exactly trying to do uh, what I just mentioned, trying to find the truth, and nothing but the truth, in a very uh, organized and precise manner. The international community has blamed Russian-backed separatists for shooting down the plane, while Russia has pointed its finger at Ukrainian troops. Investigative journalism website Bellingcat published a report the movement of a missile launcher seen during training exercises in southern Russia on June 23rd, then in a smaller convoy heading towards the Ukrainian border. The site compared that launcher with a video filmed in rebel held territory on July 17th near the site where the plane was shot down. The launcher's painted number had been changed, but other markings on the vehicle remained the same. Finally, the site says it documented the same vehicle the next day being transported by a truck in rebel held territory with one missile missing.